Um, welcome, YouTube, to, what the fuck, okay, wrong team, shit, okay, ignore that, shitty open, shitty way to start that, fuck, um, gotta fix that real quick, ah, really shitty way to start this, um, just give me shadow sneak instead, bam, um, there we go, boom, Ready? Okay. Welcome to week three of the, um, uh, NPBL. God damn, I literally just recorded the team builder and I'm already forgetting things. Um, good luck, have fun. Um, I'm sorry for saying um so much. That was a really shitty team builder, really shitty way to start this battle, too. I was not very energetic, I know. Realized that right after recording it, hoping to bring a bit more energy to this. Um, he doesn't have the Terrakion. Setting up rocks. Lead Mew setting up rocks. Best bet. Um, worst thing that can happen to me is he leads Cafagragus. Um, I'm predicting, like, lead Pilo. That would be kind of scary. Lead Pilo. No, not scary. That would be actually pretty good, because then I can Stealth Rocks. If he stays in, I can knock off. Stealth Rocks doesn't really affect my team too much, except for, um, the Vicavolt doesn't really like it, and the, um, Incineroar doesn't really like it, but I can get around it. We, like things like Zydog and Dusclops are still fine, whereas his Charizard can't have rocks up, which I'm willing to bet that his um uh Florgus has Defog. So training rocks turn one isn't a big deal. As long as I can keep the Manaphy alive, so I can keep rocks up for that Charizard. Of course he led with this thing. Of course he did. Um, hmm, huh, would it be a bad decision to go into this? No, fuck it, go straight out into s'mores, what's he gonna do to s'mores? He knocked off my assault fest, of course he did, <laughs> uh, of course he did. Um, what's he gonna do to s'mores though? I'm gonna Dark Slayer it. Yeah, that's fine. Um, this thing here, how much does it do to Gonzalez? I don't think you guys can see this right now, but I'm on the Calx. I just wanna see Gonzalez versus Vaporeon, wish support. Um, not doing a whole lot, and I'm killing with a T-Bolt, doing enough with an energy ball that it's not staying in. It went for Wish, that's fine. Um, I can go for energy ball here. He didn't swap. To, I was expecting the 100% Pilo Swine swap, okay. Um, a lot of swapping going on. He went out to Florgus. Um, what's my answer to this? <laughs> Is it Requiem? Could be Requiem. It doesn't have a knockoff, so why not? Fuck it. What's the worst that's gonna happen? I can always wish pass on to him. I do have the Slurpuff. Um, yeah. A lot of mind games, kind of. A lot of swapping happening, all that. Um, because I'm not clicking just Volt Switch here, he's probably going to know that I'm not, um, or that I am Specs or Scarf. He hasn't seen me at speed anything, but why would you go Scarf on this thing? It has shit speed. It's... I'm Specs. I'm Specs. If you didn't see the team builder, I'm Specs. Spoiler alert.
Um, you should watch it anyways, though. You should also like that video and this one and subscribe. Yeah. Nice way to throw that in the middle of the video because I forgot to say it in the beginning. Um, kind of mad that my Incineroar doesn't have a um, Assault Fest anymore. A little bit. Just a little bit. Uh, his two wish passes. Of course he does. Um, I have no reason not to Willow here. I'm telling him that I have it. But it, it'll cancel out his... um. I mean, no, there's no reason to Willow here. I'm just clicking sh Nightshade. There's no reason to Willow. Um. Hmm. What is he going to do? What is he going to do? What is he going to do? He swaps to this thing. Huh. Well, I'm Nightshading again. If he tries to sub or something, I'm breaking the sub. Um, I think he's he's going out to the Zard. He's probably just going to start trying to set up. Um, I can definitely live a plus one. And I can haze him. Um, Charizard. Uh, XD Dance. Yeah, I can, uh... Plus one. It's really not nice, but I can live it. Even adamant, I can live at least. So screw it. Click nightshade. Um, requiem doesn't do a whole lot, so I can honestly probably sack it to the sard to get it killed by the um. Yeah. To get it killed by the banded uh, Zydog. Because as long as he's not at plus one, I outspeed him with Zydog. If he de-dances again, then I haze it off and he doesn't get anything from it. If he attacks here, I live and I get rid of his stats. So, I mean, there's no reason for me not to just spam haze from here on. And sack off Requiem. Uh, I hope this doesn't bite me in the ass. Should have made it more physically defensive. I mean, he didn't. Okay. What does this thing do to me? What does this thing do to me? Um. It's probably gonna try to set up rocks. It doesn't do enough to me. I don't do more to it though. So I can go to Adam and just set up my own rocks. He went for toxic. Okay, that's fine. I'll set up rocks. That keeps the Zard away. Now I can knock off. That's fine. I'm fine with that. Um. Yeah, I'm fine with taking some rocks damage. He pain split. Um, okay. I'm just gonna... Click Dark Slayer again. Yeah. No reason really not to. Um, I'm pretty sure even without my Assault Fest, I can live a hit from this thing if it's not invested. Could be very wrong, but we'll see against the Florius Cleric, because that's what I think it most likely is. Yeah, I can live this hit. Um, Flare Blitz does quite the number to this thing, too. Over half. Oh, it killed! It's not max defense! That was his defogger. Um, now his Zard has to come in on rocks, and it's already low. His Zard is useless now. Um, this could be a win for me. I can definitely, I'm calling it too early probably, but I can definitely see myself winning this now that that is screwed, but this thing is a problem. Does this thing outspeed me? Um, I'm just gonna go for a Dark Slayer yet. 
and C. I'm probably sacking this off, but that's fine, because then I can go to Zydog and Banded Crunch It. It outsped me. Holy shit. Um. Holy shit. Holy shit, this thing is gonna sweep me. Um. My only hope is to go to Requiem and haze it. But I need to sack off. I need a clean swap, so I need to sack this off here. Yep, that's fine. I need to haze you. Right now. I need to haze you. I'm living that. Yeah, I'm specially defensive. Thank y'all. Shadow Sneak. Um, now I can go to you, and I can kill with a banded crunch. I outspeed you, guaranteed. And I kill with a banded crunch. That's fine. Sweet. Okay. I think I win. I'm probably calling that way too early. He still has a Vaporeon, which is kind of scary. But I have the Vicavolt. In fact, Vaporeon is probably what he's going to go into, because it's probably defensive. I went to this thing. Can this... What does a banded crunch do to this thing? Um, Pilo Swine. Um... Oh, an Ice Shard's gonna hurt like a bitch. That's what. And, yeah, Banded Crunch is not doing nearly enough. So... Adam. Mew. Yeah, Icicle Crash. Not really appreciating that, but I can... Um, Soft Boiled. He went to this thing. I can knock off. He went for Wish. What's he gonna wish past you, the Zard? Probably. Um. He just stayed in and scalded. Fuck you. You're a bitch. Aw, oh, you suck. Um. Screw it, he's going for Scald again. Damn. That was awful. I'm glad he didn't burn, though. Oh, I'm so glad he didn't burn. Um, uh, I calc this earlier. He's probably swapping here, but to what? He's probably swapping to the pile of swine. That would be his best decision. Um, I'm just clicking Volt Switch, because last time he didn't swap to the pile of swine, not, of course. Fuck you. Ugh. I gotta go to the mule. I'm sacking. I'm really playing badly here. I am really playing badly here. I need to knock off here. And knock off either this thing's Eviolite. That's fine. That's fine. Because now, without Eviolite... Um... Without Eviolite, I can go for Energy Ball on this thing, and 122, I outspeed this thing. It can only Ice Shard me. I'm going for an Energy Ball. Um, I'm living that, Energy Balling and Killing, that's fine. But with Gonzalez so low, this Vaporeon kinda handles me really well. So I need a wish pass to you. I need to get a wish pass to you. Badly. Really badly. Um, I'm Specs. Do I kill the Zard? Or is this game because I let him... Um, I'm gonna check if he Megas, because then he resists the energy ball. I won't kill, will I? I might... I don't know, 60, he loses 50%, yeah, I, <laughs> if I get a mineral and I don't kill, I swear to God, if he goes to the Zard here, and I get a mineral and I don't kill, I quit, because that's the second time that's happened, yeah, of course he does, it's at 88 though, um, Vaporeon, 
Um, Energy Ball has a pretty decent chance to kill, but it outspeeds me. So I need a Wish Pass. That's what I need to do. That's fine. I can take that. I get burned. Oh well. Wish. You wish up too. That's fine. Um. I'm gonna safely click Dazzling Gleam here. Yeah, that was fine. I was kind of expecting that. Yep. Um. Neither of my Pokemon can really take this Scald though, can they? Um. 33%, that's killing Gonzalez. And Beast Boy. 41 to 48 percent with rocks that's definitely killing so I just need to stall this then <sighs> fuck I lost GG I lost as arrows doesn't kill and he ice he has ice beam GG um yeah I called that way too early I got way too cocky that was 100% my fault. Um, I definitely could have won that battle. Uh, yeah, I definitely could have won that battle, but I played poorly there towards the end. I made a lot of stupid plays. Um... GG to Adam. I've been helping him team build and stuff, so I'm glad to see him win. Um, um, so yeah, that's the end of the battle. I'm going to end the recording here. And I will see you guys in the next video, which will most likely be my week six battle in the IBL, which was supposed to be last week, I know, but didn't end up happening. Um, but yeah, I'll see you guys later. Bye.